we will be working on our siblings so close your eyes sit with your spine straight and imagine your siblings in front of you your brother your sister in case you don't have real brother sister think of the cousin who's close to you who was close to you or any friend who was just like your sibling now go back to your childhood and think how the relationship changed from a loving relationship to a troubled relationship and reflect in your mind that the moment you think what feeling comes into your mind are you feeling heavy somewhere just think which part is feeling heavy are you feeling heavy in your heart do you feel like crying immediately just evaluate your feelings now think deeper why am i having these feelings what is it which is bothering me what exactly happened which memories have come back to me immediately what needs to be resolved why am i still not okay just reflect and identify the real reason everyone will have a different reason now pray to god i humbly invoke for your blessings to be able to release this emotion because of which i am not at peace right now i want to release this emotion take a deep breath hold and exhale and imagine all this emotion is coming out from your body whatever you are feeling just let go inhale again exhale all these negative emotions imagine ki ji aapke andar ek balloon tha jisme halka sa puncture hua hai and dheere dheere bahar nikal raha hai uska jo kuch bhara hua tha whatever pent up emotions were there they are coming out inhale exhale now think again are you feeling a bit lighter is the load little better release further lord god help me release these negative emotions what i am feeling i want to let go of this baggage inhale exhale all the negative emotions i'm sure you must be feeling lighter now imagine telling your sibling god brought you here in this family for a reason we were happy but we kept fighting also now go back to the childhood and see was there any sibling rivalry between you two or if more than two siblings were there 
pour your heart out say i was not happy when people compared me with you they compared my achievements with your achievements i was demotivated by that i never told anyone but i kept going inwards kept shrinking it was not your fault but i kept blaming you for that i'm sorry we used to fight on petty issues and that converted into chit for chat attitude from me and those small revenges converted into big rivalry i'm sorry for that i'm sorry for all the things which i had hidden from you remember you were looking for that book and you were not finding it it was me who had hid it i'm sorry for that i'm sorry for eating all the chocolates which you had hidden from me and you were wondering all the time where did they go it was me who had done i'm sorry you remember you had a new dress and you were wondering who wore it i was the one who had quietly worn that dress and gone for the party and kept it back i am sorry sorry for the stain which i had put on your dress your new dress sorry for breaking your favorite gift and never telling you that i was the culprit sorry for telling your secrets to your best friends it was my naughtiness but i never imagined that i'm going to hurt you so much for that i am sorry i was immature now think of the time when your sibling has hurt you it is very difficult when someone you know someone you love says i hate you how to deal with this first step is to be aware you have to accept and be aware you have to acknowledge and say i don't know why my sibling hurt me maybe even your sibling doesn't know the reasons behind her choices human behavior is very complex so the best way forward is to be aware and then accept whatever has been done to you accept your sibling for what who she is and what she did he, she or he this is a crucial step to forgiveness if you cannot accept your sibling's choices to hurt you you cannot forgive easily acceptance doesn't mean that you are approving it or you will let it happen again acceptance means you stop wishing that it didn't happen when you keep wishing oh i wish it had not happened means you have not accepted it accept your brother or sister the way they are similarly allow yourself to accept for who you are it is very important in forgiveness so say i salute the buddha nature in you i salute the divinity in you i ask for the forgiveness for all the injuries i have done to you and i also forgive you for any injury done to me i let go completely i am sorry please forgive me and i forgive you too 
i am learning i am growing you are evolving i am also evolving i am sorry please forgive me and i forgive you also when our parents are not in this world who will i have as a family i will have you only so let us bury whatever bitterness we had in the past and move forward and let us teach our kids also to forgive each other every day so that when they grow up they don't carry baggage of the past things which happened in the childhood or when you were adult or any other things they should learn to forgive every day and not to carry their burden to the future for the better relationships so imagine now you are going ahead smiling at your sibling hugging talking nicely holding hands in hands walking happily inhale slowly exhale inhale all the forgiveness exhale all the bitterness inhale exhale we are starting with the meditation now <laughs> 